everybody, welcome back to another video here for YouTube. Um, today's video is going to be an unboxing of the Absolute Carnage Funko Pop. So, I've been pretty excited for this one to come out. Um, one, because it is, uh, it is the, the cover from Absolute Carnage number one, which is very iconic cover that was created um, and there's a lot of detail in this pop so I'm gonna get this out of the box um, and we're gonna do some closer looks at it um, before we do that though let's just take a look you know regular Funko Pop box it's the uh, previews exclusive um, the back shows absolute carnage shows the pop um, Nothing, nothing too crazy here. Decent sized pop. Um, so let's get this unboxed. So the cool thing about this pop was, in addition for, to them creating this pop, like in my mail call video, um, you watched that, you saw there was also a cover for one of the comics that came out at the same time. Um, it was for Venom 27 and it featured the Funko Pop version of Absolute Carnage on the cover. I have that sitting here as well. Um, awesome cover. Uh, and we'll see the details on here, you know, showing Rogers, Logan, Parker, Brock, all their gravestones and the skulls and stuff are gonna be on this pop. So, whew, yes, okay. So this is pretty cool. Um, so like I was saying, we got Rogers, Logan, we got Brock, Parker, all the gravestones labeled there. We got piles of skulls on the bottom. Really cool. The Funko part itself, pretty normal size. Um, let me grab one just to compare overall size for you guys. Um, and what better one to grab than the Corrupted Venom Pop. So size comparison, yeah, a little bit taller. Um, you know, he's standing on a grave though, so makes sense. Um, pretty decent size though, nothing too crazy. Um, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna just shoot some uh, close up views for you guys down here and um, I'll give you my final thoughts on it. Okay, so like I was saying, here is the Venom 27 cover with the previews exclusive limited edition. We see our carnage here on top of Eddie Brock's gravestone with the Rogers, Logan, and Parker gravestones. And here from the bottom up, we've got our skulls. Um, and see Parker, Brock, we see our Logan and our Rogers headstones, and here he is. There is our absolute carnage, crazy Funko here. And I'm gonna turn this, you see the back, you see the tendrils going off on all the different headstones there um, this is pretty this is pretty cool this is uh, this is what I was hoping it would be um, I know some people were saying they thought it was going to be a lot bigger than it was um, but like I showed before you know a little bit taller than a regular Funko Pop uh, head the you know same size as a regular one but you know that's what it should be this this um, depiction of Carnage right here, you know, he's not that full-blown uh, monster version the, with the Grendel um, in there, or you know, all those other pieces of the codexes, code, codexes in there. Um, so this is exactly what I was hoping this would be. It's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, so. Final thoughts, um, great pop, great detail. You know, we've got the null 
um, swirl going on there, which is awesome. And, you know, there's probably a way they could have thrown some more details in there and could have been a little bit more crazy. But I'm gonna give it a, you know, nine out of 10 because it's got the detail needed for a Funko Pop. It's not, it's not some expensive figure and uh, it does the job. I like it. Thank you guys for watching this review of the Absolute Carnage Funko Pop. Uh, I love it. I hope you guys, if you are really wanting to get this, can find it, add it to your collection. Um, and as, as always, thank you guys for watching my YouTube videos. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, let me know if you guys collect Funko Pops or um, if you're gonna make an exception just to get this one because it's, it's pretty cool. Um, thank you guys for stopping by and collect what you love and let's talk comics.